everybody, Billy from Mutation Creation. Today, we're gonna do a, a gene that I have quite a bit of in my collection. Um, and if you don't, you're gonna need it. It's a very, uh, one of the base genes that um, you, you really need. It works in clown, it works in pie, it works in lab, it works in ghost, it works in everything. You know, it's almost like Orange Dream, but it's Enchi. It works in everything. So, we're gonna be doing this. I gave, uh, a good variety of, of color and stuff and combos and some recessive stuff and single gene, two, three, four, I think I even have a five gene in there just to give you some variety. But first, before we start looking into the Enchi, we're gonna uh, give a shout out to JDH, Reptiles. Slacking, right? Yep. Slacking like us. So, um, if you're not following them, they have uh, Instagram, um, I believe Facebook, and they also have a, a YouTube channel. So, do some Enchi. Love these things. Love them, love them, love them. Okay, let's do the base Enchi first. Now, even though we say base Enchi, this here isn't just an Enchi, this is, what, head la oh. Double head uh, dream. Double head dreamsicle, so. But to give you an idea of the Enchi, a lot of weird banding, what, what Enchi's really known for too is, is the, the coloration. It's almost golden and it's pixelated a little. The saddles, well I wouldn't say saddles, but the, what do you call it, the banding? The banding's really bold and has usually gold around. What else do you have to say about it? Not too many alien heads, <laughs> Yeah. cleaned up. That's why we, it's more of a, of a banded. It just cleans everything. But this color, it's so, it's so different than just the regular brown. It's almost like a goldy brown and it really pixelates into a different color. Almost like an orange, halfway down. Just a real awesome gene. That's it on its own. And where are we going from here? We're gonna go right to the four banger here in the same box. You can jump to the middle side. Okay, Come so. Come back to that one. Ah, you know, let's see, we'll get, we're gonna do this. We're so unorganized here. But, so, actually, you know what? We're gonna do it like this. We have to start stacking it, because we're gonna start going to a four, five gene and then come back, it's gonna be, so go I'm to already the, confused, so we'll go here. Yeah, that one. Yeah, should've just listened to you in the first place, man. Let's, why don't, why don't I know by now, hey? I just, I should just listen to you. I, I should, I just gotta get, make this so that I know that we come back to it. So, Base Enchi, add the, the line of fire that I work with. I work with both fires, um, but this is the Creed gene. So this here, just by adding Creed, bam. So that line of fire, just for comparison, you take this, add the Creed, bam. And one thing is I know what Creed does. It's not really that visible in, in, uh, in Enchi, but a lot of, I guess, like reduced pattern near the tail. Not so much. Connected alien heads, the saddles. But just look at the difference. Just one gene the Creed or Fire does. Then we're gonna take that, and here. Take away Creed. Take away Creed, and then add Mojave. So this is a Mojave Enchi, or what they call it as a, a Mochi. So the Mojave influence gives it a lot of color. Adds those little dots. And, and, and patterning inside the Enchi. So this is a, a beautiful example of a Mochi that doesn't want to stay still. But I need you to stay still because I'm bringing out one of your siblings. Now, this one here is everything together. So this is a, a Mojave, Enchi, and Creed. So if you notice, the Creed really, really, really brightens up and cleans up the Mojave and the Enchi. 
You can see still see the Mojave pattern and the, the not so many, whoops, sorry guys. But look at the difference between the two animals, just in color. And also, like I said, here's the, the Mochi, Mojave Enchi with the Creed. Really clean, sort of reduces the pattern at the very back of the snake. So once again, Enchi Creed, Mojave Enchi, Mojave Enchi Creed. Now these also happen to be Het for Caramel, Het for Ultramel, and Het for Cryptic. So these whole backs are really awesome. So some really cool, amazing, amazing combos in the future with those. And the four banger. Wanna go to the four banger next? Might as well. Get it out of the way. That's another four banger, so. You're the director, man. I'm just following you. <laughs> okay, so this one here, this here, it's got a lot of jeans in it. So if I am correct, this is a pastel Enchi Leopard Asphalt. Possible hep pied. So, we should have had a, I don't have just a normal leopard, but you guys know what the leopard gene looks like. You can sort of see it in the pattern. Also, a little bit of the color, but the Enchi gives it more of a golden tone. And then the yellow belly as well. In this case. Oh, sorry, the asphalt. Yeah, my bad. The asphalt, you know, is giving really a lot of flaming coming up the sides. And then the pastel also adds. And with pastel, enchi, and leopard, it always gives like a little skull or a cross, a skull and crossbone sort of thing on the head. But I would say a lot of this color and the pattern is because of the enchi influence. Enchi is very strong an influencer in, 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 some, in some genes with, with pattern and color. So I'll put this one back. Now this one here, this here is awesome because Enchi has a super form. This is a super Enchi. Orange Dream. Yellow Belly slash Asphalt. Came from a freeway. I don't know. You can see from the belly, the pixelation. A little bit, of, a lot of, well, I wouldn't say f really flaming. I mean, th there is. It's very pixelated, so it's hard to tell what we call flames coming up from the belly. But it's yellow belly or asphalt. Super Enchi. Orange Dream. I'm just trying to see if I have, I don't have a regular, I should have had a regular <clears throat> Super Enchi to compare, but I'm slacking. It's basically Super Enchi just adds a lot more banding than the regular Enchi. And it's not as bright, the tone is a little muted, darker, yeah, muted, and darker. They always have this little diamond shaped like head stamp. You know what, I'm gonna, here, ready? Here's my Super Enchi breeder. So, see what I mean? That's, this is a breeder Super Enchi. Okay, of course she wants to take off. Got that little, that same head. Diamond shape. Like the diamond shape. But if you notice, the OD and the yellow belly or asphalt, see the huge difference in color? And as far as the flaming, not much flaming coming up. I mean, it's hard to tell. A lot of the color from this animal is coming from the OD as well as the asphalt slash yellow belly. So, let me get her tail in. Of course, this one's moving on me. 
So this is my adult Super Enchi. So by, you see by adding some colors in. Want to add in the more color? Show them the banana Super Enchi. Oh, okay. Look at you making me work. We showed this in the banana video. So, same animal with banana added. Same kind of pattern, really banded. See A lot of, head. you know, the checkering near the belly. See the head? This one too has a diamond shape. It's almost like a little crest almost. -er. So just by adding one gene, you take this super asphalt, holy, super enchi, and make a super enchi banana. It's, it's, I love, I love the super uh, enchi stuff. A lot more, a lot more stuff. I want to start adding super orange dream, super enchies, um, super pastel, super enchi, super OD, you know, triple, quadruple supers, phenomenal. I think they even look better. And when you have one of those animals, the power of that animal is amazing. So. I'll do this top one right here. This one here? Yep. Okay, so these are just some combos that we've got it in. Enchi Blackhead, Het Lavender. So you take the dark blackhead gene, add some Enchi, you get the combination of both. Has very dark. Looks like a darker Enchi. Yeah. Nice. Blackhead. The gold tones and some of the patterns from the Enchi. It's not as banded as a normal Enchi because the blackhead sort of pulls these saddles together. Can't wait to see uh, both these jeans inside of a lav. Unfortunately, this one is in shed, deep shed, but you get the idea. This is an Enchi Lavender Asphalt. So these there's so many oranges and reds. I don't know if you can pick it up. I mean, it's so faded. These are real clean and white. These are orange. These, these flames coming up from the asphalt. They're almost red. They're, oh, like, unfortunately. You can almost see it on the camera. Can you? Okay. And then see the head. When it comes out of shed, it's so much nicer. Look at that head. So this is an awesome animal. Going to be using this to get into my freeway project and super asphalts. Imagine a super enchi, super enchi, super asphalt. Be sick. Or even more, super enchi, super asphalt, lavender. Wow, and then add some blackhead and leopard and nuts. Uh, so oh, everything. Like just, the sky's the limit. Makes sense. Don't search that. I got, I got all these to go through, man. Stop going through all the other stuff. I can't be showing off everything. I'd be here for, I, I could, you know, hi, this is the 40th animal. Now there's the 150th. Like I have so, when I have 2,000 animals, especially with genes I like and I work with, I have it in everything. So stop pulling me away. We've already, you've already taken me to two different, two different breeders. Actually, you know what? You want me to do one more too, I know. Yeah. So. So do the middle one first. This one here? Yeah, but we'll jump to that. Uh... <laughs> Okay. A snake right there. So, really? Oh, yep. please. What happened before with all the other ones? All, oh, I did this, this? Fifth, fifth or sixth video and now I'm running all over the place? Making me work, bro? Okay. Enchi Pied. So, Enchi and Pied pulls a lot of pattern, as you can tell. Low white. Instead of having saddles, or you know what we call a saddle blotches on the pied. We it more it's more of a of a pattern. Same banding, same pixelation near the belly, but with the pied, they really give some beautiful gold and oranges. So really amazing animal there. And then you take that and you go super enchi pastel. And this is a pied, visual pied. 
But Super Enchi is a really, really low white pied, and there's Pastel. So just incredible. There's like an E right there. Yeah, there is. <laughs> Look at you looking. And then I'll show you one more. Oh, it has a face on his face. Oh, I see that sort of. Looks like a doll of a baby. Whatever you say, man. Sure, other people will see it. Or a silhouette of a baby. I guess. Of, well, okay. <laughs> and here, this here is, this is just awesome. Frank, if you're watching, look at this. This is going to the U.S. This here is an orange dream, yellow belly, fire enchi piebald. What? With some nice emojis on him. Yep. This one that way. This one that way. So orange dream, yellow belly. Yellow belly has these pixelations and the weird pattern. The fire's making it pop. The fire's also making it very high white. Mixed with uh, the Enchi the and and bring some pattern back. Bringing the pattern back and also the color. This is more of a purpley, softer than just a black tone. But just incredible animals. Look at the head. Pop the head out. Crazy. Orange Dream, Yellow Belly, Pastel. No, sorry. Enchi, Fire. I'm thinking it's so bright. Yeah, Fire, not Pastel. Oh my, that's a continuation from the last video. Pastel, pastel, I must have said it three times. No pastel. No pastel here either. Orange so, dream. Orange yellow. dream yellow belly. Fire and she pied. There you go. Yes. No prob, no prob. Let me put her away. Put this one here. And put her back. Hopefully that's the last time I'm running over to the adult rack. This will be her first year breeding. She's a 2018, looking good. I might get you to run over one more time. Oh my God, what do you mean, Mike? That, that, the way you said that, I mean, I'm, I'm actually going. <laughs> Let, let's go somewhere crazy with this now. I'll go this one right here. I was gonna go crazy crazy. You wanna just that's, go that's crazy? That's too crazy. That's okay, too so crazy we're gonna go crazy or crazy crazy? You gotta like, can't blow them away. Okay, yet. so we're gonna go crazy. At least crazy for me. You know, that, that ain't hard, cause I mean, I'm already halfway crazy. So, this one here, next morphs, Got to give them huge shout outs. I saw this guy on, on on their table. Phenomenal. When I was out at the uh, the W the Western Canadian Reptile Expo. This here. Ready? Come on. Come on. Relax. Relax. Okay, I might need a hand. This is It's 5 gene. Orange dream. Cinnamon, Enchi, Fire Vanilla. There you go. Crazy. Head. Look at this. This thing is just the, 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 it's almost peach. Like, it's just, oh, I love her. Him, 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 him. And has a little bit of a ringer. Just really different. Really different looking. Saw him and I'm like, wow, I, I don't know what I'm going to do with him, but I, I definitely want him in my collection just to look at and, and have as a, as a something to, to have a base. And I'm going to be adding more pattern into this and a little bit more vibrant colors, maybe take some away. But just looking at this animal, if I could even just reprodu reproduce this animal, I'd be super happy. You couldn't though, because if you breed this animal to a normal... You, can you can't get the vanilla and the fire at once. You can o only make enchi vanillas. And oh, because of the fires. cinnamons. That's right, because it's vanilla, a lilac. Cinnamon, yes. I, but I can still make it if I put it with those other genes in it. Yes. So. Cinnamon and enchi You're, you're right, lilac. but half right. Cinnamon and enchi are lilac, as so are fire and vanilla. So you can never reproduce this snake from breeding from it to breeding a normal. From breeding it to a normal, correct. But... I can still reproduce it with the other genes. Of course. So, and I have those, so we're both right. Well, definitely. <laughs> I'm more right though. <laughs> yeah. Sure. Okay, now. <sighs> really? That's the biggest thing in the show. Yeah. Your time is done. 
Next. Let me see if I can do this. Ready? Mm -hmm. This here, this is a pastel Enchi Desert Ghost. Look how this female, this female is just getting better and better. Look at that head. Pastel Enchi Desert Ghost. The thing is glowing. Nuts. That's the DG. Pastel is given a little bit of color as well. The banding is the Enchi. So is the relieved large eye stripes. Just stunning. Pastel Enchi Desert Ghost. So sick. You need all these jeans. You need Desert Ghost, you need Enchi, you need OD, you need Tide, you need Clown, you need Yellow Belly Asphalt, you need Blackhead, Cinnamon, you need them all. And you just keep creating crazy stuff. Like there's no end to this. You know, and then I pull out the dark stuff and it's like, wow, and then the light stuff and then it's just nonsense. So I love it. It's crazy. How could, you not, how could you not love this hobby? Huh? Before you open that one, this is where I wanted you to run over. Oh, now why? It's just the banana Enchi. No. I don't, that, it's a banana Enchi. We saw it. But does it show the difference as a baby to an adult? Oh, man. Really? Some people are going to think that they have banana Enchis that aren't banana Enchis. But then again, too. No, because the thing is, is some of these have more pattern. And, and I mean, some of these are het and some of them. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Still think you should show it. No. Uh, we'll see. So, here we go. Ready? Banana Enchi. Heck Clown. Okay, Austin's shaking his head. Why? You got it mixed up. Oh, this is okay. This is the pie. Yes, I see what you're saying. Because I'm sitting there going, wow, really colors. Okay. Really nice this is a Enchi. banana Enchi OD Yellow Belly. Heck Pied. So. Banana, the Enchi, you can see with the pattern. Yellow Belly and the OD is giving it the brightness, very clean look. Orange Dream's really cleaning up this animal. The flaming coming up the sides and adding a lot of the orange is the uh, Yellow Belly. And can't really see the Hep Pied markers, but this came from a visual pied. And then the next one, here, this here is a banana Enchi. And this is the Heck Clown. This is a male, and it's also a female making male. So, of course, now I feel obligated. Just put them right here. Just watch. Watch. She doesn't take off. She doesn't take off. Oh, he doesn't take off? Here you go, Austin. You happy? Yeah. Banana Enchi. So. Hatchling. Two-year-old female. So it's still, still in the head. There's still a little bit of blushing in the head. But really orange here. Here it's more, you know, yellowed out or softened. And she helped the banana not to get too many spots. Yep. You got a few, but nothing compared to just a normal banana. Yeah, normal bananas have a lot of speckling. So, banana enchi female. Banana enchi male hatchling. Getting some exercise in today, man. Quarantine, you need it. Whew. So, let's do some of these. Enchi clown. You take the clown, add some enchi. You get that golden color. It takes a lot of the uh, alien heads away. There's that that color change halfway down. Goes from like this bronze to like a gold, yellow. Cool head pattern. Very reduced and, and, and almost like a striping. You're not working with me, are you? Okay. 
Gonna add some pastel to this. And then you get a pastel Enchi Clown. So pastel really gives you a, a, a different head stamp. Pastel Enchi head stamp. Normal Enchi. Pastel Enchi. Doesn't want to be a star of the show. There it is. But patterning still the same. Pastel really breaks it up a little bit more. Gives you a lot of that that gold. It turns into a yellow here. You can see. So this here really gets more brighter with the pastel. You get a lot more blushing inside the dorsal. the dorsal stripe. There's still some here, but you just don't really see it as vibrant as here because the contrast between the black and the the bright. Bam. And then I showed this one off before, but you just go nuts and say, hey, here's a super inchy blade or a super inchy uh, possible super blade clown. Really cleans it up really makes it uh, color. I want to see what Pastel and OD does to this. I think that'd be sick. Crazy head stamp. Just like talking about reduced pattern, same thing. Color comes down halfway down or so. The color of, to the belly changes. Sort of lightens up and blends in a nice sort of really, really awesome. Oh, we still got lots to go. I know. You brought a lot up for this you one. You did. So here, this has some color. What's this? Ooh, I can see OD just by looking at it. Here, this is an Orange Dream Enchi Ghost. Orange Dream Enchi Ghost. And here's an Orange Dream Enchi Het Ghost, right? Super Orange Dream. Ooh, look at me. Enchi well, that's why ghost. it's so bright. Yeah. Yes. And not only, yeah, I can see that now. Look at the, the Super Enchi. Holy, the Super OD. It's giving it that really clean, very, the, the colors here are so intense. If it was a Super Enchi, it'd be a lot more, less pattern. It'd be tighter and the head would be totally different. So. Super Orange Dream Enchi Het Ghost. Orange Dream Enchi Ghost. Orange Dream really cleans up. Gives it some more color. These guys are just ready to take off, but... Love these things. Look at this color. Like, look at this. So awesome. Enchi works well with... Many, 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 many jeans. Many. Every recessive. So versatile. And super totally changed the looks and the appearance and, and adds so much more. Do that one last. <sighs> Save the best for last. Okay. Now, ready? This is, these all have to do with my freeway or my asphalt stuff. Stuff that I love. This here is an Enchi Hidden Gene Woma Freeway. Look at this thing. Okay, so Enchi Hidden Gene Woma Freeway. Just crazy. This one here, this is an Enchi Freeway. 66% Het Clown. But we're pretty sure it's Het Clown because Normally, a Mardi Gras or Entry Freeway is more red and doesn't have all these really dark tones in between. And I have her sister from the same clutch, and they totally look night and day. I've, I've shown them in, in another clutch or another video back in the day. She's in shed, so we couldn't bring her over right now. But just look what Enchi. Enchi's, Enchi is giving this all the color and the pattern. Like, it's just amazing. So, they're really taking off. Brings in some nice burnt reds. Burnt oranges, I mean. 
It's almost like like a salmon color. Salmony pink. Really amazing. Just, oh, I love them. So much to do. So much more. Go here. Ready? Got yeah, three in here. Mm. Cool. So, this is an Enchi Fire Freeway. So, Enchi Fire Freeway. Add Super Enchi, and here's a Super Enchi Fire Freeway. Big difference. See the heads? Heads a big giveaway. See what has that Super Enchi, has that shield, or that little diamond, as, as Austin calls it. So, same animals. This is an Enchi Fire Freeway, and this is an Super Enchi Fire Freeway. Look at the tones. Like look, oh, like, look at the colors on these animals. This, this is a lot. Oh. You can see a lot more banding in the Super Enchi. But look at the, the colors. It looks like it's, it's you know... Um, some energy running It's like it. burnt. Like, you know what I mean? Like how they, they highlight, you know, with wood. They burn the with wood the and it's, it's, it's just, look at this thing. Yeah. Look at these colors. I mean, the contrast in these are insane. Look at this. Look at these heads. There we go. Of course, I have to get Enchi into my freeway stuff. I love it so much. Here, this here is a pastel Enchi. Freeway, possible fire. So basically, it's this animal here <clears throat> without the fire, or possible with the fire, but adding pastel. So these could be the exact same animals, except this has pastel, or this one may not have the fire, but it's really hard to tell, but really bright. They're just so amazing. I love my freeways, and adding Enchi into them has not been disappointing at all, to say the least. Like, look at those. And even these, these have Enchi too, of course. More stuff, like, yeah, I love Enchi in my freeway stuff. There's even more you can show. I know, okay, like, come on, I'm not walking around. Oh, where do I start? You know what, I'm gonna do this, and then I'm gonna do the start last Start the dark first. Thing. Yes, that's what I was gonna do too. Nuts! Okay, super asphalt, pastel Enchi. Now, if the camera doesn't pick up the contrast and the colors in this animal, I don't know what will. Pastel Enchi Super Asphalt. Like, what the? Look at these. Come on, man. Look at this. Are, you, are they seeing it? Can you see that? It doesn't pick up as nice and person. Ugh, like the, the reds, the oranges. Like, it's... Hues of pink. Salmon even like look at that belly that that you know, but it's almost like uh, I'm gonna say like pepper peppered Yep. Even really towards the tail too Like look at this this look at the contrast from the top pastel enchi super asphalt come on guys look at this Wait till I get super enchi into this and OD and super OD and then banana and lavender I should have some of this with lavender in it like are you kidding me? This, oh my God, so sick. I love it. Oh, right? Yeah, I'm crazy, I know. <laughs> and then this one has needs no introduction, but we're gonna show her off last. This here is the very first freeway I ever made, freeway clown I ever made. This is the Pastel Enchi Freeway Clown. This is my beautiful girl. Look at this head, look how Get out of the light. There you go. Look how intense that head is. Let me just see if I can. Just nuts. And look at the colors, the purples, the like, ah, oh, the yellows, the oranges. It's almost tangerine and citrus. And look, look, they're just. Oh, I love her. I do. It's like every time I look at her, look at look at the the difference in contrast between her belly, the white. So, just insane. So, super happy with this one. 
Once again, Pastel Enchi, Freeway Clown. One of my favorites. Definitely, definitely going to be making more, as well as having lots of clown. Lots of clown. Lots of Enchi into these projects. So, hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Hit the notification. Where are you going? I'm, I'm doing my thing. I'm doing my... Candy. They gotta watch me while I'm doing my stuff okay. with my hands. Ready? Do your gang signs. Okay, ready? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I guess. I don't know. Short bus gang? <laughs> yeah. Who knows, man? I don't know. Anyways, <laughs> hope you liked the video. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Hit that notification bell. Keep the comments coming in. And now, Austin, you can pan. There you go.